Hello there, good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. So in this video, I'm gonna teach you how to design a free birthday card in Kittle. So as you can see right here, I am currently inside the Kittle website. So the first thing you want to do is of course, check on the templates on this sections right here. So look for the one that says cards. So it should be on the middle section right there. Click on the see templates, and then once you click on them, you'll see on the lower side, it will load up. You can filter them, for example, you have baby filters, birthday, business card, certificates, and so on and so forth. You can also check on the trending by name or most used. So since we're looking for birthdays, might as well click on the birthday right there. And there we go. We have this choices of templates. So with this one, just choose the templates to work with. I'm gonna go with this one. Like so. So welcome back to the video. This is gonna be inside the editing platform of Kittle. And once you choose a template from earlier, you will be automatically directed here. So you can edit everything here. I suggest, of course, customizing them as much as you can. Because if you don't customize them, it will be, um, let's just say a common happy birthday card or birthday card, right? So let me just tell you the tools and tips that I commonly use on editing some cards here inside Kittle. So once you click on any section there, for example, this happy, there is a text section, right? You'll see the settings on the right side. You can change the color. For example, you can make it a little bit more yellow. Perfect. Like so. And then you can also change the border width. You can change the text font right there. Let me choose this one. I think I like this one right here. It's much more bold. It's much more giving like so it's like a graffiti you can change the weight right there but for this like, specific font it only has regular of course the text size is right here and here's the thing about Kittle that I like about most most of the business cards or birthday cards are in circle motion or they have this circle icon so might as well have this custom circle or like so and then as well as this one right there of course you can invert it to make it into a perfect circle. And those are the tools that are commonly used on using or clearing cards inside Kittle. Of course, we can forget the left section we have here that says textures, templates, text, and elements. So if you click on textures right there, you'll have a lot of things to choose from. The most favorite one I have personally is this paper texture. It will change this business card or birthday card or whatever card you have into a textured paper, like so. It's much more realistic if you're gonna ask me. So you can change the background color, of course. For example, you want it to go a little bit more red. There we have it. And of course, here's the fastest way on changing colors. You'll see this option in the lower right, the project colors. For example, I choose green. It will automatically change colors regarding the green colors. Everything that has this red, will have it right there. For all of the yellow, for example, you can edit it like this. So you don't have to manually select the sections or the outputs, or what you may say right that, to change the colors. You can just hover your mouse here, and then check the colors which corresponds on the one you're liking. Of course, you also have to add some text here. For example, I'm gonna add this one. And then I'm gonna write a name, for example, let's just say Joseph. Let me highlight this one. Sorry about that, it's selecting everything. So that will be Joseph, perfect. And then I'm gonna delete this one because I really don't need the subtext right there. Give me a second. I think it's following, perfect. So Joseph is right there. Let me move the flower, perfect. So that is how to add a name. Of course, change the text color. Can't forget about this. And then you have another thing to work with. For example, you want it flag, wave, rise, or arch, or distort rather. I think this angle suits better here. And basically, I'm good here. If you want to check the designs and how it look like, you can click on download or mockup right there. If you click on mockup, you'll open up this option where you can check how it looks like on different suits. For example, you want to create your business card inside a greeting card right there. So click on this one, 
for example, and then wait for the project to load up. So basically that is how it looks like inside the card in real time or rather in real life. How awesome is Skittle, right? You can even view how it looks like. And that being said, go back to editor. If you're satisfied with this project, simply click on download and basically PNG or JPEG that will be depending on you. And with that being said, thank you so much for watching. Please hit the like button, subscribe. I'll catch you guys on the next one. Goodbye for now.